Hello, my name is Maisha and I'm an instructor at GREC. In this video, we will tackle the matching sentence ending or question. Ta tackle korpo. A question is usually reading. Aasha. So basically, a question is you have a list with sentence beginning and another list with sentence ending. Do you have a match or you have a grammatically correct sentence? A question is how do you A question is how skill test. Kare. The first skill is how do you information to information? Second is how do you grammar test? Kare. Now, a question to answer for a journal quite the steps at First, question to buche passage or the information to locate korte hape. Locate the information in the passage. Second, understand the meaning of the passage and the question. Because question to passage thike paraphrase kare hape. As in, same meaning but different words. Thirdly, the sentence must be grammatically correct. So, the first part of the sentence and the second part of the sentence must be grammatically correct, accurate. Last is, the sentence options may be more than needed. First lister and second lister, act the beshi option So, for example, to the actor option er, apnar hoche duita mona hai you choose to choose which one is accurate, both grammar-wise and meaning-wise. So, meaning and grammar are both Here is an example for the question of matching sentence endings. Here is your passage and this is your question. Your passage or paragraph states, Chocolate has a high amount of sugar. It is made with cacao beans. The question is, chocolate has option A, very sweet, option B, may have cacao beans, option C, a significant amount of sugar. Let's see which of the options is correct. C chocolate, very sweet. So chocolate has a high amount of sugar, which means chocolate is sweet. But is it grammatically correct? Chocolate has very sweet. So grammatically, it is incorrect. The second option, chocolate may have cacao beans. The keyword here is may have. In the, in the passage, it states it is made with, which means that it is must. Chocolate must be made with cacao beans. All right, which means this sentence is information is wrong. Third option, Hoche, chocolate has a significant amount of sugar. Does it match the sentence? Okay, chocolate has a significant amount. Significant is the synonym for high. So, question ta information ta ke paraphrase kore lakha hoche, which means option C is the most accurate. Grammar, grammatically ki take. Chocolate has a significant amount of sugar. Yes, it is grammatically correct. Meaning is the same. So number C is the correct option. So as this example, please make sure that your meaning and your grammar is correct. That's all. Thank you very much.